Hi everybody! Today I want to talk about one NBA player, Yao Ming. He has a great impact on me. I remember when I first time hear about Yao Ming. In 2008, I was studying in junior high school. At that time, I always played basketball with my classmates in PE class. In 2008, Yao Ming got the hurt on his left foot. He missed the NBA Game Offs in 2008. However, we are lucky that we can see him to join the 2008 Olympic Games in Beijing, China. Flag bearer, of course, Yao Ming, the basketball star, leading 374 very proud Chinese athletes. Yao Ming is not just a very famous basketball player. Uh, he can bring a lot of commercial effect to America and China, these two countries. Firstly, to American. With Yao's success in NBA, NBA gets lots of Chinese fans and audiences. Because of Yao, the NBA league experienced a huge increase in their television rating. Chinese stations expanded their NBA coverage, and uh, you know, China has become the largest foreigner market in the league. Basketball's been called China's fastest growing sport. It's a fact that's clearly catching the NBA's attention as some of its biggest stars visit their biggest potential market. Yao Ming's effect also helped the NBA stars like Kobe, like James LeBron. Secondly to China, Yao Ming helps to increase the Chinese basketball players, their images on the international sport stage. Also, Chinese Basketball Association learn a lot of things from NBA, such as the All-Star Game. One World Sports coverage of the 2015 CBA All-Star Game. Keith Arizari and Scott Green on the call with you. Yi Jin Leon, Stefan Marbury announced before the game, he, the leading vote-getter, Marbury, a cultural icon now in China. And, he... and CBA also will be more and more like NBA because they will combine the sport with the business and become more creativity to promote their game, their uh, association. And according to USA Today reported, uh, Yao Ming's effect can be compared by the Nixons visiting to China. Yao Ming as a basketball player uh, can make the China with American have a closer distance in these two countries. I think that's a very, very good thing. Thank you for watching.